Hello everybody and welcome back to the Excessive Gaming Channel and Farming Simulator 19. Today we are up to episode number 26 of our Let's Play series, so if you could quickly drop us a like, it would be very much appreciated. And of course, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well. So today, episode 26, what are we doing? Well, as you can see, we are up here at our new house and the uh, big farm. The new farm, whatever you like to call it, and as you can see, all of the uh, crops have grown. So the wheat, first of all, when we separated, then we've got barley, then we've got the oats, then of course the uh, canola or rapeseed, <coughs> and then of course the massive plot of soya beans. So yeah, what we are going to do today uh, is of course some harvesting. We are of course, as I say, uh, start of a brand new week. So uh, yeah, why not start off with some harvesting. Now we need to uh, jump into the John Deere 6250R. Still got that uh, Lemkin cedar on the back. Still get this field done here so we're not going to go too far with this equipment. That there. And of course what we need to do first is get the harvester sorted out and of course we need something to unload the crops to which uh, you may recall we didn't have any trailers available to us we do need a trailer and what we're going to do is head down to the store because we have uh, we have already purchased a trailer for us for this harvesting whilst we're down there. What we're going to do is get uh, this tractor serviced, as you can see in the bottom right hand corner. And, uh, the bar there with the spanner on, and it's sort of right down to the bottom near enough. We can have a little bit left on it, but uh, yeah, we need to get this serviced pretty quickly. So we're taking this to the shop as well. get the vehicle service, get the trailer picked up, as you can see there. I'm not sure where the service bay is. Park that into the bay. And we can repair the uh, front loader. I'm feeling I'll keep doing that. Yeah, there we go. So, <laughs> age is 10 days old apparently. So, I'm sure it's more than that. So we are going to repair that for £2,000 expensive business. So that's that fully serviced. And so we are going to pick up the trailer now. This is of course the uh, Agriliner, the uh, Krogh TKD 302. get that back to the farm and then we can of course start some harvesting. Now the harvesting itself we are going to uh, do it in stages, we're not going to do everything today. It, uh, take some time to get bits and pieces done and get uh, all the equipment put together. We're going to harvest a couple of different uh, crops today. We've got five crops planted. Those soybeans are the biggest crop. More of that than anything else. But, um, did we actually buy a trade? I can't remember now. 
Obviously, we just think about it. We surely must have had a trailer to feed the pigs with. I can't quite remember which one we did when we leased or we leased a trailer for that. But nevertheless, as I say, we need to get this done today. We'll just park that up there for the time being. So, and then we can, of course, run back and grab the harvester. So, yeah, as we say, episode number 26 today. It's another week. Uh, obviously, next week we are going to be doing our Euro Truck Simulator videos, but we are away on holiday with the family, so uh, all that will be pre-recorded. So we've got an awful lot to crack on with this week. Let's uh, open the garage up here. <coughs> this is of course the harvester that we purchased. Uh, would have been in the last episode, the Friday's episode. This is the John Deere uh, S790. Big massive harvester. Climb on in there. Get it all started up. we want that header unit as well that trailer up we can of course head to the field Our private road, so nobody should be down this road at all. We'll do as well, uh, park up the trailer here somewhere. There. Get that header loaded on. So, and of course, we're ready to start harvesting. So, we need to unfold the harvester, of course. I think we are going to turn off the uh, straw swap at the back just to uh, we don't need it today. Where are we go. There we go. That is uh, harvesting as simple as it comes. <clears throat> Excuse me, all set up and ready to go. As I say, we are harvesting wheat. We have to get that uh, get that all done. Well, like we say, episode twenty-six today. I think we will harvest the wheat, the barley, and probably the oats today. We harvest three of the five crops here. So how quickly we can of course get this done. But with this uh, huge harvester and the big header on the front, we should get a fair old bit done in one go. 
The thing is, of course, we do need to empty out at the end of uh, each crop. We can't uh, mix up the crops at all. Do have to bear that in mind. Of course, we want to get uh, our big field planted up with the crop as well so that we can get that growing. But, uh, as we say, all that's going to be this week at some point. got the majority of the wheat done already. Like I say, we will be uh, replanting this field up as well, so that we can keep crops coming in. I think what we may do at some point is uh, get some potatoes and sugar beets on this, on this, this field as well. Let's spit our words out. do is get a whole crop harvest done so we can fill up those uh, silage pits as well. So we will need those later on. Of course we've got the silage pits at the farm and we've also got the silage pits here at the biogas plant which we can uh, do something with. on the big field directly in front of us there. It's an absolutely huge field. What we may do is uh, a whole crop harvest on that. It'll certainly give us plenty to uh, be doing. It'll yeah, take us a fair old time to get it planted and have to harvest it as well. There we go. So we can turn off the harvester. As you can see, 85% full. A fair old bit of wheat there. To bring the pipe out. Because, for the sake, we have finished the uh, wheat harvest now. Back into the John Deere 6250R. I'm going to open the cover up on the uh, Agroline trailer. Of course, uh, get all that unloaded. Now we was considering run in, running a second farm on a different map, of course. But, um, let us know your thoughts on that in the comment section down below. Let us know. Do you think we should do a second series alongside this one? Uh, we're going to be doing this a fair old uh, bit of time. So, uh, we'll do. Right back in. There for a minute, just whilst we uh, get rid of this. Yeah, as I say, we were thinking of running uh, another series, except for the map, of course. So uh, let us know your thoughts on that on the comment in the comment section down below. Let us know what you think, should we do that kind of thing? If uh, you think we should, let us know which map of course you'd like it to see as well. We'll unload that there. That'll all go into the silo. 
ready for uh, feeds, etc. And then just wait for that to come back down and of course go back to uh, the field. But yeah, as we say, try and consider running a second map. I know there's a, quite a few maps that are now starting to come out. We are, of course, playing on the Xbox One, so you need to bear that in mind if you are saying yes to a second series and use such and such map. Shut that off there. Jump back into the big harvester, start it all back up. So this of course is going to be the barley. Let's see, we're going to have a couple of different crops today. Perhaps we don't want a too long episode. At the same time we don't want to uh, cut anything too short. Right, I think what we'll do just cut the, the barley today and in the next episode we can finish the harvesting with the uh, oats and the canola and spend a bit longer doing the uh, soya beans that we've got on the field Very busy week planned, unfortunately. A very busy week this week. We're not going to be uh, all over the place. There's meetings and appointments to attend, and such and such. Shot for today. And we can remember where we put the button, of course. Quite sure the best uh, to do a screenshot for today. So we'll do uh, a few different pictures. Of course, we can decide accordingly. see the uh, beacon lights have now come on, that's because the trailer, or rather the uh, capacity of the actual tank itself, is over 80%. I believe uh, should have enough to get all the way to the end. 90% well, I mean, pushing it though. Trailer, uh, empty the uh, tank out. 98 percent. Yeah, we are. That's typical. That is. So yeah, we're gonna have to uh, quickly grab the John Deere 6250R. Oh. 
but I'm green. Mr. Worker. Unload that into the trailer, of course. A little bit of it in there. Seems to be more barley than what there is uh, wheat. Not sure why that's worked out that way. Can uh, bring the auger back in. Turn off those lights, flashy lights. We don't need those on, of course. So we can now wait for that walker to go back in, we can of course fold that up. Let's see what we're gonna do is uh, just park this up for the time being. Shut that off there and then we can uh, finish that off uh, in tomorrow's episode. Barley on, take that back to the uh, silo system as well. And uh, again, keep that for a feed if needed, or if there's great demand for a good, very good price that we can sell it. There we go, that's that lot all tipped into the uh, silo system. So, so there we go, episode uh, 26 of course today. And so we are going to uh, end it there and get uh, a lot done this week. But, uh, if, of course, you have enjoyed today's video, remember, of course, to drop us a like. It would be very much appreciated. And, of course, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well. Again, it would be very much appreciated. And, of course, uh, if you could share today's video with family and friends or anybody else you think may enjoy, it would also be very much appreciated. Well, like we say, we'll shut off there. That is going to be it for today's episode. So we'll come back tomorrow with uh, some more harvesting we can crack on with the oats and of course the uh, canola well like we say that is going to be it for today thank you very much for watching and we shall see you in the next one bye for now